We finally reached Arizona. We're in Tucson right now. Uh, we're currently going to get Thai food. We just left the Planet Fitness. I inhaled an entire bag of gummy bears in like three seconds on the way here, so I didn't work out because my stomach's killing me. But now we're going to get Thai from Tuk Tuk Thai Street Food. Try saying that three times fast. Dude, I've just been sliding closer and closer to see how long it took you to notice. <laughs> this is the hoop of highness. <laughs> you get way too high, you just turn this on and sit here. You're good. This is the safe zone right now. It's the anti sea bear circle. Yeah, what you said. <laughs> hey. <laughs> oh, <is that> <laughs> it's super zoomed in. It's a really pretty shot. Hmm? <laughs> you want some milk with that? Milk is disgusting. Oat milk. Even more disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's little balls everywhere. I haven't had this many balls near my mouth since that one time I drank too much tequila. <laughs> We're in Tucson, Arizona now, and we've only been here for a few hours, but we were just at like a traffic light, and there was one car in front of us, and then I was behind it, and the light turned green, and the dude didn't go, but I like pulled forward because I thought he was gonna go, and then it turned red, he still hadn't gone, and then he jumps out of his car and starts walking toward the van all angry and cracked out, and what was he saying? Telling you a vision to get off his fucking ass. <laughs> then sat through like two more green lights until he jumped back out of his car and came back a second time. And then that's when I took over. <laughs> Steffi just rolled her window up and like I, I was like, keep the demon in check. Then he came back a second time and I was like, oh baby. <laughs> yeah, Morgan was gonna kill him, but um, I'm glad she didn't. I have not served these hands in a while. <laughs> But call them bitches Krispy Kreme because they were hot and ready. <laughs> I thought he was gonna attack me, like open the door, because he started walking toward the van all aggressively. It was just peak my excitement. He started walking towards. Us, I was like, oh, I got time. I got all the time. My ba my only bad thing though is the baseball bat is under the bed right now, so it wasn't in reaching distance. That's probably a good thing though, because if I'd had that bat on him, I'd have just kicked open the door and just been like, all right. <laughs> Let's go. I will beat the tweak out of you right here on the streets of Tucson. <laughs> I'm afraid he's gonna like come find us. Please do. Please do. <laughs> oh my god. Make my day. <laughs> I gotta get more high because that is, I was super stony baloney and then fuck crackhead Carl came up and, <laughs> and then the demon came out and the adrenaline dump completely killed it. <laughs> I gotta get back to chill. Man. <laughs> Sorry all the chill hippie people that follow Stephanie and are, are, are like peace and love. <laughs> I'm like that too until people f*** with my friends and then I have to kill them. <laughs> this is Sarah. You're officially in the vlog. Oh, that's scary. <laughs> What did you get? Tacos, duh. What kind of tacos? Angus steak tacos. Cool. I got steak fajita tacos. What'd you get? Tacos. Fish tacos. Oh, fish tacos. <laughs> so the internet said this joint closed at nine. They closed at eight and it is 8.20 right now. We're the only ones in here. It's really quiet. Eating our dessert. Yeah, eating our. On, but hey, <laughs> we got the uh, we got the restaurant to ourselves and margaritas, so not complaining. And hat to ourselves. It's making fun of me for wearing the mask through the restaurant when it's closed. Great night. You too, bud. Okay, so we just left dinner with my friend Sarah, and now we're heading halfway to Phoenix. And in the morning, we go to Phoenix, hang out with my friend Maria, who's an amazing person. Also has CF and is one of my amazing moderators on my Twitch and my Discord. So yeah, onward. <laughs> He's like, this is a trap. <laughs> He's like, I know a trap when I see one.
Finally made it to Phoenix. Had to almost beat up a crackhead along the way. That's a whole other story. We already told that, I'll upload that later. But we stopped by my great friend Maria's house. This is Maria. She is one of the best people in the world. She's also my Discord moderator. She has done a ton for my stream. And she also has CF and you're hold. 46 and counting. Heck yeah, she is 46 <laughs> leading the charge. So she's done a ton for me. My stream would not be what it is and my Discord without her. She's put way more hours into it than she ever needed to. She's always been awesome. So we came by to say hey. So I had to introduce you guys too, because how awesome is it to meet a CF for getting close to their 50s? Like, I thought 30 was a big deal. You're it's like a whole new, like, you know, like aging for us right? is, is like a celebratory thing, right? Uh, everyone everyone complains about getting old and we're just like, whoa. Yes, one more year. Although, especially, especially me, because I was like, shit, I don't have any plan. I don't have, I don't have anything right now. But yeah, it's rad. So just wanted you guys to meet Maria because she's uh, she's awesome. You probably, if you follow my Twitch, you already know her. How do you pronounce your screen name again? The Nitzia. Yeah, okay. So I was kind of close. I pronounce everyone. Well, you always call me Danny. You know? uh, yeah, like I, I just had to shorten it because I pronounce everyone's screen names wrong on Twitch. <laughs> but yeah, you guys know her from that. If you follow my Twitch, she's great. Had to meet her. We're about to head to LA now because Sunday they go on total lockdown. So we gotta go get Steffi stuff from LA, then we gotta get the hell out of LA. So that's next on the agenda. What's up, California? It took us a month, but we're finally here going through Joshua Tree right now on our way to LA. Don't know how long we're gonna be able to stay in LA, but we're gonna we're gonna see here. But yeah, checking out Joshua Tree. How does it feel to finally be in California after a month? My back hurts. So as you guys see in the vlog, we had to hang out with my friend Maria who has CF yesterday. And I left my enzymes in the van. I take a brand called Zenpep and she takes a brand called Creon. I was on Creon before, but then my insurance quit covering it, and the switch from Creon to Zenpep, no big deal, nothing nothing wrong. All enzymes aren't made the same. So uh, mine were in the van, so I took uh, the equivalent of Maria's Creon to equal like my Zenpep. I was like, nah, you know, it'll be fine, nothing bad will happen. That was a mistake. All I'm gonna say is butt water. Oh yeah, yeah, my stomach's cramping like I'm on my period right now. It's a fun time, but hey, we've made it. We have reached Pasadena. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm trying to find my sweatshirt, don't mind me. Just the shadow creature comes out from back there. <laughs> uh, we're waiting on Steffi's friend. We're gonna go eat at this place. It's like right over that way somewhere. Since they still have patio seating and all that, but it ends tonight at 10 o'clock. So the next phase of the lockdown goes in at 10. So we got one more place to eat. And then and we die. Yes, exactly. Who knows where we're gonna poop in the morning? So yeah, I don't know if we're gonna sleep here tonight. Don't, we don't plan that far ahead. Oh, yeah. We just find a place. They can't find my sweatshirt. Sorry. <laughs> I named him. You did? Yeah, cause she's like, my Prius was named Kevin. She was like, would it be wrong if I named him Kevin too? And I was like, I was really high. And I was like, wait a minute. I was like, Kevin, but K-E-V-A-N. Kevin. Oh my. And she posted it and everyone was like, genius. That is actually so good. You're welcome, have a good day. You too. Tricapta refills. We're in Downey, California. All the places online said the Walmart didn't allow overnight parking, but we found one. Didn't ask, because no one could find a manager. But no one bothered us. Like, there wasn't even any maintenance or leaf blowers that you usually get at the Walmart. So, this is a huge, like, parking lot here. So many stores, so I don't think they really give a shit. So, we're just sitting here right now. I'm debating on what kind of food I would like. Then we're going to meet up with one of her friends. And, yeah, I don't really know what else we're doing for the rest of the day. She says she doesn't feel good, but her breakfast was a packet of peanut butter, and now she's eating Scandinavian swimmer candy. <laughs> and then she'll be like, I'm shaky. <laughs> I wonder why. 
But you can't tell this one nothing. She don't listen to anybody. Welcome to my school bus conversion build. Probably a quarter of the way done to maybe closer to a half of the way done. This is this is being fancy in California. You just who needs water? You just bring your own. Bring your own Kongan water. <laughs> pH balanced. Added minerals. All that Perfect. Sketchy hotels in Anaheim. Welcome to an episode of Sketchy Anaheim Hotels. <laughs> will we get COVID or will we be stabbed? Why does it look like I'm in an OR? <laughs> I'm not sitting in that chair. <laughs> what? Why, why, why did you ask me if there was any bed bugs? What did the review say, Steffi? <laughs> oh. This is the best you're gonna get in this town. Oh god, I'm too high for this. You got me paranoid <laughs> as shit. Oh. <laughs> 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 It's a hairball. An entire human hairball. But yeah, I don't know about these sheets. I just don't know about these sheets, you know? Sir, you said the sheets look like they've never been washed, but I didn't see anything about bugs. Why didn't you start out with that? <laughs> I hate you. I can't deal with creepy crawlies, all right? I can deal with someone's like body funk. That's fine. Can I go home now, Mom? Yo, there's a man chasing another man with a broom. <laughs> Where? Right over there at the Grove Hotel Motel, right there. Dude just came running back from there, and the owner came out with a fucking broom, just swatting at him and screaming, just going, ah! Oh, there he is right there. Oh, let's, let's zoom. Oh, he's cracked out of his mind. <laughs> okay, this is the guilty culprit. Right here. This is who got chased off like a scalded dog. just so we're all like super crystal clear on the matter. I had no say in this. Steph just said that she hadn't showered in like three days and she was stressed out so she got a hotel and I trusted her instinct. Remind me to never do that again. Never, never. That's okay though. I'm just eating my sushi here. Trying to sit on the bed <clears throat> as less as possible. And you know, probably gonna get religious tonight and Pray to you know every deity I can find. Probably just gonna go on my phone, go down the list, and you know, hopefully don't die or catch the COVID or worse. I'm pretty sure this place has COVID 20. All right, so we survived a night at the Crackhead Inn, and I kept going to check to see if the van was broke into. We put the chains up on the van for extra measure. I think we're going to get coffee now or something. But we found this Thai place last night uh, that was buy one get one free for curry. We just got, we we both got two, so we have like so much curry and it's delicious and I'm excited for today because I have basically unlimited curry for the day. Yay! 